a burial plot in New Jersey. Find a car service willing to go there. Get a lawyer to draw up her papers. Pull a conservative rabbi out of nowhere. Call her cousins. Call her friends. Call a shrink. It never ends. The list of things to do when my mother dies. Write a speech to say at the funeral. Locate milk crates on which to sit shiva. Pull the family on favorite smoked fishes. Hire a caterer willing to deliver. Say the Kaddish. Say you'll mend. Say goodbye. It doesn't end. The list of things to do when my mother dies. And I'll be free. I can go and do the things I meant to do. But there's only so many years of my life that she can reasonably expect to steal. Still, when I'm off on my own and settle down and all, I'd like to be able to give her a call. To be able to call her on Sundays, to bring her groceries when it's too cold, to scold her for screwing up her pills, to give her grandbabies to hold, to give her grandbabies to hold. Find a way to mend the gaps between us, find a way to forgive and repair, find a way to tell her you love her, Find a way to show her you care. Don't take too long. Don't wait till she's gone. Don't wait till it's time for goodbyes. The list goes on and on. For my mom.